Losing a loved one is devastating, but losing a child is soul crushing. That's what one food truck owner experienced in 2020. And 1011's Anthony D'Agostino shares the story of how this mother is honoring her son. Marlena Bowdery's life was turned upside down when her son Timothy Wallace was shot and killed in March of 2020 outside of a bar on O Street. Before that, she had a successful restaurant and her son was a helpful part of the business. She remembers feeding him his last meal and since he died, cooking has been a trigger for her. But four and a half years later, I wanted to honor him because I know my son would want me to give up. So I heard my son's voice telling me like, mom, don't give up, you gotta keep going and keep going she did. She now runs a food truck with her husband. And just like her restaurant before, the food truck specializes in Southern food. We cook fried chicken, homemade mac and cheese, greens, um, just everything. Before her son was killed, he was someone who helped his mom any way he could. And now he can be there for her in a different way. This right here makes me feel like he's present. He's here with me so I can bring him along with me. Not only is she cooking soul food, she's cooking food for the soul of others. I'm helping other grieving mothers to help them conquer their triggers, to help them cope and deal with their grief. And her son is there right beside her, keeping her grounded. Each time I feel like I'm, um, I can't go on with life, my biggest motivator is my son because I hear his voice like, Mom, keep going. You got to keep going. You got to keep going. Reporting in Lincoln, Anthony D'Agostino, 1011 News.